So I'm back with another video. Yay! I haven't done one in a little while. Um, I just haven't really had much to talk about. Um, but recently I have decided to take out all my extensions. Um, actually, recently, meaning just like last night. Um, I'll go on the way my room's kind of changed. Um, so it looks a little bit different to last time. And my hair is obviously much, much lighter than last time. Um, I decided to just start doing my hair at home, the blonde, um, because it was just getting too expensive. It was getting like $180 um, every six weeks and it's just too much. So I just decided to go really, really blonde and um, that was a bit of a change, um, a change that has really helped my um, confidence. Um, and I just wanted to kind of vlog, vlog, vlog about last night. Um, I redid my roots last night and um, normally what I will normally do is when I get ready I will just blow dry and straighten my own hair and then like as I'm actually straightening the hair like so I'm going like that I actually put the extensions in so I never actually get to see my hair for how it actually is and um, I decided last night that obviously I was going to bed so I wasn't going to put my extensions in and um, I just had a look at it I just observed my hair and I'm like Oh my god, it has grown so much. And it's to the point now where I actually feel like I look normal. Like you can't tell like that I have this hair pulling. Well, you know, have, have, I don't know. It's like goes through stages, goes through weird stages where I get really bad and then I just go, don't have a problem with it at all. Um, and last night I just got really, really emotional and I felt like the, for the first time in seven years I can actually just wear my hair and feel good about it and um, feel like normal like you know for the last seven years since I was 15 I've had to wear extensions every single time I leave the house and I wear my hair down can you imagine that for seven years you have not seen people have not seen your own normal hair there's always been clips or or glue in extensions that's just that's just so like weird to kind of comprehend that I can't just wear my own hair and you know I was thinking about like I have never been to a pub or a club and not had my hair extensions in like never I mean that's nuts that's so long to not have to you know, like, I've never worn, not never not had extensions in when I walked into a club or a pub. I mean, that's so weird. Like, to, on this Thursday, I've decided I'm going to just wear my hair like this and see and see how I go. And if I don't feel confident, then I don't feel confident. But it's just a new... I feel like I'm kind of almost letting go of it. I, I woke up this morning and I felt good about myself and I felt like I could look in the mirror and I was like, you know, my hair looks pretty nice like this. And that is just such a, a foreign concept to me because every time I look at my own hair without extensions in, I always felt really ugly and different and so envious of other girls' hair. You know, how, you know, because a lot of my friends have beautiful long hair and I just think, I wish, I wish I could just have my hair like that. Um, the pulling has kind of been on and off. I think it's more so the um, treatments and the... Um, hair tablets that I've been taking and I just haven't really been trying with it I've just been letting it grow and um, yeah just using lots of um, leave-in conditioner because obviously the bleach like I bleached it once all over to get this color and then um, I've just been doing my roots so actually these bits haven't been dyed for um, since like you know at least September so um, when I was getting the foils um, she was doing it all over and I think maybe that's why I got a lot of breakage because now my hair has just seemed to have grown so much and it's so good. Um, I'll show you the back because obviously the, 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 the uh, bits at the front are still shorter than the ones at the back because obviously it all grows and yeah so it's still short so the back uh, I'm never good at this but this is the back um, hopefully I got that in so How, I don't know, <laughs> I can't tell until I actually stop recording and check it, but yeah, 
lots and lots of tears, um, lots of talking to my mates, and I put a photo of my hair on Instagram. Um, I just feel, it feels like a new day. It feels like the next phase of my life. I feel like I'm letting go of this. And um, I don't think it's through technique. I think it's just through evolving within yourself and, and deciding that enough, it's, it's time to finish this now, it's time to let go of this and start moving on with life. So, um, yeah, I'm really appreciative of the comments that people leave and I always try and write back. Um, yeah, this is just a little vlog video just to kind of um, talk about my hair, how it is now. So it's because it's been since like May or whatever since I've made a video. Um, so this has been... Oh, eight months nearly of of progress so if you want to go look at how my hair used to be go look at my very first video it's called Trichotillomania a personal story thanks for watching guys